Hey guys, it's John, and welcome back to my playthrough of Silent Hill 2. You may notice that my face cam is a little bit clearer, and that's because I finally took the teleprompter off, which was making it all blurry for months and months, uh, because I don't use it that often. I had a teleprompter, if you didn't know that. It's for the main channel videos that are scripted, so I can read it off. Anyway, I know I'm like, I know I'm like in a 240 by 240 resolution uh, box up here, but maybe you can tell the difference. Anyway, um, right, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, uh, in the last video, we started going through Toluca Prison, and we're still there. Legend says he's still there, even to this day. I'm having a, a zero sugar soda. Hope that's okay with you. Can I just live my life? I'm gonna timestamp this section and call it. John puts his foot down. Um, right, so we got something here. What did we get here? Oh yeah, we got the weight from the typewriter. And there's like a million little bugs out there or something. Let's go kill them. I'm gonna kill you. Oh, it's the, it's the mannequins. If I could get on the intercom, you know, this is like the one place where you think there'd be like an intercom. I would go over the intercom and I'd be like, ah, attention all mannequins, your days are numbered. And then that would be it. And then the mannequins would be sitting there like, I never know when my time is up. It's gonna really mess with them. That's the true psychological horror. But then here's the kicker. I just don't kill them. I just let them keep living. And then they're just gonna be, you know, run around this place being like, when is he gonna kill me? And it'll never happen. Okay, when would you say, or what, 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 how would you say is the best way to get to the yard from here? Oh, I think right here, actually. Yeah. Or is it, oh no, this is the ox place. Well, we could just go right here. You hear all the mannequins skittering? They're freaking out right now. Uh, okay, that makes sense. Right, because the weights are... The weights have been shifted, so the ox door isn't open anymore. Well, then what's the point of this shortcut? Okay, I guess I'll just go back the way I came. Sheesh. Uh, read what you saw. I think it's this way. Kind of an awkward backtracking. Is this what I'm supposed to do? I might have... I might have been meant to do something else. Can I go to the warehouse? Hmm. Maybe. I actually... I, I wasn't able to go in there earlier. It was locked. But now... We might be able to go in. See, I hear stuff in there. I might be able to go in right here. Oh, okay. We, I think we always could go in. Oh, what the? Ah. Oh my gosh. Pay no attention to the horrible shooting. That was a mistake on my part. We're not using a health drink. It's not happening. We're gonna hit 40 this video. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's my goal for this video. Making actual progress in the game is secondary to, to reaching the 40 health drink milestone. Old man's always been prepared. 23. Okay, was that it? I mean, I say that, but yeah, a strange photo. That's good loot. That's good loot. I, I'm i a little disillusioned about the strange photos because I just know I've missed some, and so I'm a little like... 
Eh. I'm not gonna get them all. Oh. Okay. You know, can I just say, I love that a whole new generation of gamers is getting to experience the cycle, the gameplay loop of Silent Hill games where you check a door and it's locked repeatedly over and over and over again. See, I gotta, I gotta kill one of the mannequins, otherwise they'll know that I'm lying. All right, let's go to uh, the yard and we're trying to open I think the dove? The dove is the last one? I'm also loving that a whole new generation of gamers is getting to experience this gameplay. I'll say where I am in the yard. Okay, I'm this way. Alright, we'll just go right here. And then, uh, where am I in the yard? That's right, I'm right there. Uh, see so if I go to the left. Alright, now where's this wall? It's right here. Okay, great. Now we know where that wall is. Uh, and where's this? Is this the corner? Yep, it sure is. Because that's been great to revisit as well. We're seven minutes into the video, and about six minutes of that has been skits. Or sketches. Don't call sketches skits. The most, uh, tedious people on the internet will become angry with you. That was an easy puzzle. Give me a challenge next time. Okay. I'm just gonna go. Oh my gosh. We've gotta leave them alive in their existential dread. Okay, we're in the basement now. Okay, so we've got to go through... F1 through 15. Although... Nope, they're all there. Okay, the basement is the area that I remember most from the prison. Great. Clear. <gasps> yes. Tommy's done it. Drink number 38. He's so close to the record. Breaking his own record, I should say. Huh. Hmm, this padded cell is an Iron Maiden, I see. Wow. I always want, I always want to shoot them on their way, and I just never do. Wow, yeah, this sucks. The, 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 the weight is in there, do you see it? We gotta get it. I know you went in here, so... <gasps> uh. Now, does it hurt to go inside? I mean, I've got shoes on. Okay. Just in case. Double tapping. Alright, so we've been in there. I like the exclamation point. Oh my gosh. James, no offense, that's such a such a boomer move. My dad, my dad would, he was a big fan of the exclamation point. Sometimes he would just text me an expl, uh, explanation point. Exclamation point. I hate it when I accidentally say explanation point. Anyway, sometimes he just, he just text me an exclamation point and I'd be like, what? <laughs> and then he'd elaborate. It would always be something like, just haven't heard from you in a while. <laughs> and I'd be like, just say that. <laughs> he would just send an exclamation point. 
just because he... <laughs> I don't know, wanted me to be like... Is someone dead? Are you okay? This could be anything, literally anything. Okay, let's go up here. Yeah, he was not a big texter. I remember <laughs> he was a very he was a very caring man. Okay, don't get it twisted. Very caring. This just goes back here. Why would I care about this? I guess it's so I don't have to reopen the dove door anytime I want to go back to the basement. He was a very caring man, but he was he just when it came to texting, he could come across so cold and callous. On my birthday, <laughs> one year for my birthday, he just texted me, HB stands for happy birthday, but he didn't want to type that out. <laughs> That's a lot of effort to wish your son happy birthday. So he just, he was like, HB, he'll know what it means. <laughs> he gets it. He's a perceptive guy. He'll know what HB stands for. We could put two and two together. Oh my gosh, do you see that? It's like Mannequin Central down here. You think I'm gonna stop shooting you guys? No. I'm gonna keep shooting y'all. Another health drink. Making sure there's no mannequin like Ocean's Elevening on the ceiling or something like that. Oh my god, 39! He's on the precipice of greatness, Jerry! Oh, sorry. I I heard something and... <sighs> okay. But yeah, so James has got that boomer dad energy. Exclamation point. There's something here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> dad was a big fan of the question mark too, which James also likes putting question marks on the map. Sometimes he would just send me a question mark text too. And I'd have to sit there and kind of puzzle it out. Most of the time I would text back something like, can I help you? <laughs> to look at prison. Due to recent acts of inmate violence, prisoner D239 has been transferred to solitary confinement, cell F6. <gasps> really? Um, James is gonna mark that on his map. Question mark. Oh my God, he did it. You put a question mark and an exclamation mark over the same cell. Yes, James, we know we have to go there. Oh boy, okay. You've already established that we need to go there. We are not making much progress here. Um, can I open F5 too? Okay, I can open both of them. Is that okay? Can I... Okay, I guess... Is that all that's in here? I'll just look around a little bit. You know there's a mannequin around here somewhere. Did you hear that? Right, F1. Oh, right, it collapsed behind us. I forgot. I thought I just like locked the door. Let's go to F4, actually. F4 is kind of all by itself. Oh, this isn't a memory. Woman in flight. Wait, where does it say that? I guess it just says that... 436 people at a recital. 
Interesting, a three-digit number. Burning Man. That's Burning Man? It's not in the desert, though. Oh, it says it in the lower right. Burning Man. Okay, well, I'm glad that we were able to check this out. Now, there's, there's like, a room that's inaccessible here. It looks like. Let's go to F5. Huh. Cool. Okay, what was the point of that? See, look, there's a light. Shining from in there. Huh. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry I couldn't let them take you. And now you're... You're still there, aren't you? Um, well, I mean... Yeah, we'll get it ready. Come on in! I'm safe in my spiky cell. No one can get me in my spiky cell. Oh my god! Was that in the original game? Because if not, Bloober Team finally got to do their whole you walk into a room, the door locks behind you, something knocks on it several times, and then it opens and no one's there. They finally got to do it. Their favorite technique. Huh. Wait, did I miss this? Wait. Augie, I guess I just missed it before. Okay. Hmm. I wonder how I can get to that room, or if I can. I may not be able to. You know what? I'm gonna syringe it. Time to run around. Hurt. Yeah, do I just. I mean, I guess do I just go back up? Okay. Well, now what? Oh. Hmm. Okay, that's strange. Do I not want to be under the light? Maybe not. Yeah, possibly not. Does it go all the way down this way? I don't know. Oh! It's lit up out here now. Huh. You know what? We'll save. Yeah, no worries. Gotta have most of our save slots saying Toluca Prison on them. Hmm. Now, do we have all the weights go on the same one? The heaviest weight. Oh no, we want the sword. Right? Okay. We want to hit the sword in the middle, and it's not possible I uh, remember earlier when I was like, give me a challenge. Okay, here's what we need to do. We need to use the heavy ones first. 
Okay, so that's not gonna happen. So this needs to be over here. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh boy. Okay. You know, I bet this goes here. Really close. Oh. Oh, come on, look at that. We're just, we're barely, oh man. Let's see. Here, let's, let's take all the weights off. Maybe we can just math this out. That would be, that'd be nice. Okay, so wait, the default is right here. Hmm. That's too bad. Okay, I was about to say, if I could figure out like a quantity, if it was like one, two, three, four, five, six, for example, like this says plus one, Two, hmm, three, four, five, six. I can totally see that being the ratio. Okay. Hmm, but how does that help us? Because we start at a seemingly random amount just left of center. So close. Jeez. I mean, I assume we're trying to get the sword, right? Oh, come on. Hmm, okay. Let's take that off. Oh boy. Are we trying to hit the sword? No. Wow, okay. Oh, come on, bro. <laughs> oh, it's like we keep dancing around it. I swear, look at this. Okay, watch. When I pick this weight up, look how much it moves. I like It like barely moves, right? But then I put it over here, and it moves a lot. It moves way more than taking it off on this side. How am I supposed to make an informed decision? Okay. I wish... I wish there was a way to solve this that wasn't just like, let's just try a bunch of stuff. And maybe there is. I tend to be too lazy to try to figure those things out myself.
Oh. Yes! Execution lever. Or lever. As some might say. Not me! I wouldn't say that. Okay, now a puzzle. Let's puzzle it out. Okay. For your grace, I do not plead. For the flames I did set free. Sisters shrieked and children cried. No one made it out alive. A lot of dedication to make these rhyme. The wealth of others I did take. The seventh statute I did break. And yet my deeds I don't regret. I have my reasons. That is that. Okay, wait, there's down here. Okay. Um... What were those reasons, you might ask? The truth allow me to unmask. I see, I crave, I need, I take. Tis all the sense it needs to make. Okay, is there something that says reasons? The one I just read, perhaps? Yeah, I had my reasons, that is that. What were those reasons, you might ask? <laughs> hmm. Let's see, forgive me, child, for I have failed. To save you from her wretched ways. She whom I loved, who gave you life, a monster hiding in plain sight. I took the child, you are quite right, carried her off into the night. She did not scream, she did not bawl. I was her father, after all. Okay, so we're gonna have uh, those two go together, that makes sense. Um, for your grace I do not plead, for the flames I did set free. Sisters shrieked and children cried, no one made it out alive. Let's see, one that talks about fire? Hmm. There's so much to read here. I watched them burn, I heard them cry, I felt a soothing warmth inside. It felt so good, I cannot lie, and for my bliss, they had to die. Oh my gosh. Once the sun has ceased its reign, I cut through the rusty chain, pushed the door and snuck within, filled my pockets to the brim. Okay, so which of these? I departed with great haste, leaving not a single trace. Ever faithful to my creed, all is right, which feeds my greed. Okay. Are these like the seven deadly sins? Or something? Mommy dearest, mommy sweet, your love for me was so deep. Why oh why, you shouted out, when my knife pierced through your heart. You were oh so kind to me, filled my heart with joy and glee. In the end, it was for naught. Why oh why, you ask, why not? Oh my god. Uh, there's a million reasons. I waited long, I bid my time, I waited to commit my crime. The man appeared, he saw me not. A bloody end is what he got. In truth, he was less man than beast, and on my flesh and soul he'd feast. My will to live he'd try to break. There is so much a man can take. Okay. So... Am I interacting with the noose? Huh. Okay, I'm gonna save. I don't quite remember this, but I mean, James could die. I don't think so, but he could. It's possible. So what are we like, choosing who should be hanged of the six stories? Let's see, so the first person set a fire, um, because they're a pyromaniac and they don't regret it. And children burn to death. So that first one I'd say definitely deserves to die. Let's see, the second one is a thief. Um, and the reason that they thieve is because they want to. That's what they elaborate on the second half. 
Here, I'll, uh, just so you can read it. This is the arsonist right here. Okay. Yeah. Because I, I can read this, but you might not if you're, like, watching on a phone or something. This, uh, this is the thief. All right. So, so far, we've got two unrepentant people that are just like, yeah, I wanted to do it, so I did it. My life is about me. Me, 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 me. This one, I took the child, you are quite right. Carried her off into the night. I was her father. Forgive me, child, I have failed to save you from her wretched ways. She whom I loved, who gave you life, a monster hiding in plain sight. So this seems to indicate that a father, quote, kidnapped his child because the mother is abusive. So three seems to be an odd one out here. Let's see. This is another thief right here. Um, again, they're unrepentant. They're like, yeah, I don't see anything wrong with what I did. This is somebody who killed um, their mother, committed matricide. That's the word for it. Um, and at the end, they're just like, yeah, why not? I waited long. I bid my time. I waited to commit the crime. So this is premeditated. The man appeared. He saw me not. A bloody end is what he got. In truth, he was less man than beast, and on my flesh and soul he'd feast. My will to live, he'd try to break. There is so much a man can take. Um. Okay, so this, this, I'm, I'm a little unclear on this. It seems like a premeditated crime where they just, like, murdered somebody, and they're trying to defend it at the end, like, yeah, well, he was gonna eat me. <laughs> what? Kind of sounds like Eddie from the cafeteria earlier. Yeah, I killed him because he looked at me. He was making fun of me. I feel like three is the odd one out here. Because it's not... I don't know. It's, it seems to be different, right? I'm not sure if that means anything. Okay, so it worked. Or <gasps> Am I in the other world now? Wow, that's all it took, huh? These are all gonna be locked. Oh my gosh, no. Yeah, we're in the other world. That person, I think they moved. I think their feet moved. Don't make me jump. Okay, there's nothing else to do. Sure. Go ahead and jump. jumping again sure you don't want to drink first James look to your right you thirsty There that I could have interacted with.
Okay. Yeah, let's save here. Where does it say I am? To look at prison? Oh, the labyrinth. Oh, we're done with the prison. Huh, I'm wondering if I missed something in the prison. There's a part that sticks out to me a lot from the original that I thought was in the basement prison. Like the, the prison, the basement of the prison. I don't think it's in the labyrinth. Oh my gosh. Wait, what? The body of a man later identified as Thomas Oro Lumberjack, age 39, was discovered in the mm, something room, lying face down, I think. The probable cause of death was multiple stab wounds to the front of the neck and the left side of the torso by a sharp-edged weapon. The estimated time of death was something between 11 p.m. and 12.30 midnight. Due to signs of struggle in the room and the lack of a murder weapon, police are considering this a homicide and have opened a murder investigation. Furthermore, given the fact that the cash in the room was untouched and Mr. Oro had a history of drunkenness and violence, the police suspect that the motive was not robbery, but a crime of passion. Because what? Yeah. A crime of passion, you say. <gasps> okay. Well, it's not exactly how I wanted it to go down, but... <gasps> Health trick number 40! He's done it! Yeah! <gasps> oh, yeah! Where were you when we hit 40 health drinks? James be walking around like clink, 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 clink. He's got 40 drinks in there. He's a thirsty man. What can we say? Um, anyway. We'll go for the 50 burger next. Yeah, I love destroying TVs. Where's lazy game reviews? They'd be incensed that I'm destroying all these CRT monitors. Please. I'll be good, I promise. Tell him I'll be good, please. Angela? Angela, it's me. No. Please. Daddy! some of these health drinks because apparently I'm an idiot. No, he keeps grabbing me. Okay. 
Don't worry, guys. There's another health drink for us right here. Oof. James is thirsty, let me tell ya. Okay, I used up all my rifle rounds. Angela? She's still in there? Oh wait, what? Wait, where are we? Oh no. Yeah, we're back. Okay. I guess we have to go this way then. There she is. some uh, alcohol bottles on the shelf over there. Gonna go back down to 30? I'm doing a bad job of dodging him. That's my that's my issue. that teddy bear again hmm this is like a hiding place Angela's hiding place maybe
that's actually... I don't have to use all the shotgun and rifle rounds on him. I can just iron pipe him. That's what I was trying to do in the beginning. But I just wasn't... I didn't realize how much damage the bear hug did. Okay. The warring fan, huh? You can kind of, you can hear all the manipulative, abusive language coming through. I take care of you. No one else cares about you. You're a burden, you know, type of thing. If it wasn't for me... If it wasn't for me, you know, um... You'd be out on the streets. Interesting that the the TV explodes by itself if you don't hit it.
It's okay. Calm down. Don't order me around! I'm not. I just... It's okay. It's over. Don't even try. Try what? Like you don't know? I see what you're doing. It's always the same with you. You're only after one thing. Angela, please. You don't have to lie. Go ahead. Say it. Or you could just force me. <laughs> like he always did. <laughs> You disgusting pig. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. Angela, I don't know who you think I am, but I don't want to hurt you. I just want to get my Mary back. You're Mary. Your own little Mary. At least she was. For a while. What? Admit it. You didn't want her around anymore. No. You probably found someone else. No! I need to find my mama. Got an achievement, unforgivable. Defeat the abstract daddy. So yeah, um, yeah, this is probably probably one of the more infamous Silent Hill bosses. Um, and this version was this version of the boss battle was quite extended. In the original version of the game, and I may be misremembering because apparently I'm misremembering a lot of things in this uh, playthrough so far. But I think in the original game, it was just that final room that we went to in the remake just now. It was just the final room, and it wasn't all that lead up, wandering through hallways and stuff. That seems... That seemed very much a Bloober Team decision. But, of course, I could be mis misremembering. But I'm pretty sure that the boss battle was just that final room. Um, lots of, you know, graphic imagery there. Um, even the abstract daddy himself, you know, what looks like uh, a bed frame and sheets, right? Um, yeah, Angela's, Angela's story is very tragic. Um, I think, I think uh, now that we're, you know, through it, I gotta say, I think Angela's depiction, her, her voice actress and... <laughs> Everything is done very, very well. Very well. Um, it kind of makes all the complaints that I've seen from, you know, anti-woke types look even more silly now. Oh my gosh. There's been, there's been a lot of, uh, buzz from those types, you know, about, uh, her redesign, basically. Ooh, they made her ugly. Yeah, they made the... They made the CSA victim ugly. Oh. By the way, she's not ugly. Not that it matters, but, um... Yeah, I, I think I actually, you know... They made her younger looking in this one. Um... 
and the, the voice sounds much different. She has like kind of a deeper voice, but I feel like it totally works. And the emotions, the range of emotions that the actress was able to give there was really good. Um, actually, I prefer the original's depictions of some of the characters so far, but I say I much prefer the remake's depiction of Angela, actually. It's, uh, wow, we're really low on ammo. Abstract Day took a lot of, a lot of ammo to get through. Um, anyway. Oh. Labyrinth. But yeah, that, that was definitely kind of a heavy segment. You know, I tried to give a warning for it in the last video just because... You know, and there's even even beyond just the boss design itself and the hallway leading up to it, you know, you saw a lot of pistons, you know, moving back and forth, and there were, like, breathing holes in the wall, and lots of, um, like I said, graphic imagery really makes the whole thing very uncomfortable. But that's one of, um, Song Hill 2's specialties. And I think it was done pretty well there. I'm still kind of... I think I might have to, like... Since it was so much, you know, they extended the sequence by quite a bit, at least from what I remember. I think it's going to take some time for me to really think about it and how I feel about it. I do feel like the prison section... I don't know, maybe I'm just... Now I'm, like, questioning how I'm remembering things, but there were some parts in the original game, in the prison in particular, that I feel like I remember kind of vividly that we didn't experience this time, so I don't know. I'm not... I'd, I'd say the prison in the remake is a much weaker location overall than Brookhaven Hospital was and um, the apartments, so... But yeah, let's uh, go ahead and take a breather, okay? Uh, we'll be back right after these messages. All right, we're back. Back in the labyrinth. Wow. Stare into the abyss. A lot of bottomless pits in this game. Oh. A lot of locked doors. Oh, I thought we were gonna have to jump again. Oh, okay. Maria? Maria! I thought that thing killed you. Are you hurt? Not at all, silly. But the thing. It stabbed you. There was blood everywhere. Stabbed me? What do you mean? It chased us to the elevator and then... James. What are you talking about? Just before. Don't you remember? James? Honey? Did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? <laughs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. How do you know about that? Aren't you Maria? I'm not your Mary. So, you are Maria. I am. If you want me to be. All I want from you is an answer. It doesn't matter who I am. I am here for you, James. See? I'm real. Don't you want to touch me? I don't know. Well, 
if you happen to make up your mind. I'll be waiting. I, uh... I'll find some way to... I'll come back, I promise. What was that all about? <laughs> um, right. Oh, if we try to go back right now. We'll be locked. Oh! Was she humming? I'm bad at recognizing tunes. I don't know. Can't tell you. I'll let you know it alls tell me what she was doing. It was Mozart's etude in E minor, clearly. I'm gonna have to figure this out. I don't know. Uh... Oh, I see. We gotta line it up with up there, right? Or down here, I guess. All right. Um... Can't go up that way. Oh. Right. I guess I'm supposed to find a way for me to come in down here and come out up there. So look, there's uh, like a triangle right there, right? Now, I, I haven't been up there, haven't I? Like I haven't, ah, it's blocked. Okay, so yeah, that is what I'm supposed to do, I guess. Okay, in that case... Okay, so... Triangle. Where's the triangle? There's... So, like... So that doesn't work. Interesting. done it. I have completed the level. It is finished. You know, all this, all this peeling wallpaper makes me really want to, like, look at my own walls around the place. In real life. Maybe scratch with my fingernail. Are you about to peel? And I just never thought about it before? We don't actually have wallpaper. Well, that's not true. In my daughter's room, there's some wallpaper. 
We put up some cute baby wallpaper for her. Rotten area map. Oh, okay. Well, there's not really much here. Oh. Look at the roaches. Think I didn't see ya? Me and my army of bugs. We'll get you, James Sunderland. I'm bringing out the rifle. I'm gonna try to kill any enemies we see with the iron pipe, but if not, the rifle comes out. Oh, jeez. Okay. So I just cut it? No. Oh. With what, you may ask? You don't appear to have anything. Wait. Okay, so this is real. Quote unquote. What am I hearing? Oh, it's a, a Mandarin. This way. The labyrinth. Oh, wow. Nothing there. I didn't want to use the rifle on the mandarins. Huh. Probably just dodge them, yeah. Because from what I remember, they take a lot of firepower. Ow! What's this? Anything? We gotta stay above 30 health drinks, y'all. I don't know when exactly they were. Okay. Probably didn't need to hit him with the rifle. I just wanted to. Okay. I just wanted to. syringe. Damn, I'm dipping under 30 health drinks. No, we might not hit 50. Oh my god. Are we just in here? Oh my gosh. Okay. So where is this? Right. Okay. And we'll take this and move it. Okay. 
right here. I like the walls bleeding. <clears throat> Scope it out first, James. Oh my gosh. All right, let's go in. No mannequins allowed. I don't make the rules. Oh, I see. We'll go there in a second. Hmm. That is gross. I can't even imagine how bad that smells. What is it? James, what are you doing? All right, good. I found something I can use. Is it lighter fluid? Oh, sorry, lighter gas. And some ammunition. Huh. A door painted. Wonder why. Just wanted to try. Ugh. It's like viscera. Okay. Oh, come on. Come on, dude. Hit it. Ah. Not possible. Oh, a health drink. Oh, this is over here. I see. Okay. See, I thought that I was like, that looks like a crawl space, but I couldn't interact with it. All right, we need more than that, though. We need like a lighter, match something. You know what? Should I do it? I'm gonna say I'm gonna save my rifle ammo. I don't know. I successfully dodged it though. Are you kidding me? Okay, I guess, yeah, it's locked over there. I guess that's all that I got from this side. No, not yet. I thought we were gonna cut it, but I guess we're gonna burn it. All right, let's go. Cage there. Okay. Tentacles. All right. Here we are. Ah, we're replenishing our health drink database even as we speak. And then, yeah, on this side, it was covered up with iron bars, so. Uh, I had to do it. Ow. You little. Huh? Another one? Okay. Were you even protecting anything? No. There's not even any loot. You 
know what? This is what we got the health drinks for. We can still hit 50. I don't know. Are there even 21 health drinks between now and the end of the game? I think we may have missed our shot. I think I used too many of them against Abstract Daddy. Oh boy. James, look, it's another hole. Oh, don't act like you're apprehensive. You know what you gotta do. He's doing it again. Lighter wick. Does it say wick on it? Okay, well, I think we know what to do with that. Thing is, how, how, what are you gonna do, huh? How do we get back, though? Oh, okay, I see, and then this links up. I was trying to get away with uh, saving ammo. That's my bad. Okay. Oh, does this open? The radio was still going, so I wasn't sure. And we've got ourselves an iron key. Perfect. Um. Oh. A syringe. I'm going to save this for when I get hurt. You might say, aren't you hurt right now? The answer is not hurt enough. Okay. Yes. Good. All right, let's get the cage now. Hmm. Wait, what? Okay, what if... Wait, I need, I need three? Oh, a wick, possibly for a lighter. I thought that we had a lighter. Oh, I guess we should go back then? It's in that, I must have just missed it. Oh boy, yeah, I definitely, I thought, okay. Go to the corridor east of the suspended cage. Oh! Okay, here, I'll tell you what happened. Cause you're probably like, what an idiot. I thought that the iron key for some reason was opening that door. It opens that door. Okay, all right, we're all caught up. Momentary lapse of judgment. Oh, I got hit, no! 
A syringe. Oh. Okay, okay. And then right here. All right, all right, all right. I forgot about this door. It even circled it on the map. Whoops. Okay. Ow. So is it just too hot? It hurts James's widow fingers. Owie too hot. Just in case there's an enemy here. No? Don't be, no mandarins here. That's what those things are called, those upside down hanging things. I don't make the rules, okay? Okay. We burst the pressure. Oh no. The toilet, it, it exploded. Now we can get it. Broken lighter. Okay, so now we can repair it though. Now we've got the fixed lighter. Nice. Here I go. Now we're gonna light this thing. Heavy, huh? You want to jump in there? Okay. I don't get it, but sure. Listen to him. He's still scared. This is what? The eleventh time we've done this? Nice. Gonna do the video game thing where I look behind me first. And we're back here. Huh. Well then. Wait, 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 what is... Oh, that place is sealed off. Now what? Or now do we go see... Oh, it's over there. Let's go see if anything changed with Mary. Maybe her behavior is different. Maybe she's humming a different song. You never know. I recognize the song. I'm tone deaf, so don't pay too much attention to the notes. Okay, it's more about the general pattern. Okay, so we want one that's... Oh boy. Is there like a sign? Oh, okay, gotcha. That's what we're looking for. We'll look for it first. Nice, okay. That's much easier than having to like line them up. That ain't gonna work. Just want to look, okay. Come on. 
desolate area. We're not gonna save there, we're gonna... We're gonna be risky. Hmm... Pyramid Head may have been here. Oh. Shimmy? Yeah, well that makes sense, because why would you... Shimmy when you can just walk through the door, right? What, you go down here? Here we go. The, the rebuild begins now. Oh my god. I was like looking for... I was like looking for the mannequin because I was like, this seems like the type of place a mannequin would be. And now we got that red stuff on the edges of the screen and it's driving me nuts and I'm gonna use a health drink. Yep. The rebuild must be delayed. <sighs> okay. So that, that goes back, right? But obviously we're gonna go down, right? I'll fight you. Flooded level. Alright. That'll do it. Where? Come here. Yeah. Okay, so this is going... Might as well go this way for now. Okay, this goes back up to one. I think that that was the first one that I saw, right? We're obviously wanting to look around the entire level, though. <laughs> Are our dreams of 50? being dashed. I wonder what type of health drink this is. Like, is it just like a protein shake or something? Like, what is it? What's healthy about it? James has no thoughts of like, I gotta figure out how to mix this stuff. I'd make a fortune. All right, let's go up the, uh, wait, is it this way? Yeah. But it doesn't, oh, right, yeah, yeah, that's like a dead end. It's just like <laughs> Pedialyte or something. Mmm. Well, really good now. Okay, I had to check the corners first. Damn mannequins. Although th these high ceilings, they could be up there.
Where? Bro. High ceilings. Come here. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Okay. God, they've got like unlimited space to go. See a health drink too. Okay. Oh my gosh. So we just gotta go through the center, right? Yeah. So I thought. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Go, 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 go. Where? Let's just be on the other side of this. We shimmy. Oh, I saw it. No! Oh, okay, I shot it as it was running away. Perfect. I see you, dude! I'm, I'm, I'm meleeing you. There's no, I do not believe you. I think this opens. Wait, wait, what? Oh, uh, look, an exclamation point. James has another one. Uh -huh. Small key. Thank you. So, what does this small key open? What, did you get back up? I saw you. I saw you. Come on. Going back this way. Okay. Didn't think so. I think I think we go back up this way. Not sure what the small key opens. I think it's, it must be that one right there. Okay. How does, wait, how does James know about that? Okay, if I, oh, is it right here? Oh yeah, cause we went here earlier. What? Hmm. Handcuffed gate, no. Oh. Maybe that's what I was, oh, maybe that's what I need to do. Okay, the rebuild begins now. No? I thought I could open those. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I can't go under yet. Okay, I guess I gotta get back to the handcuff gate. Which is at the top of three. Yeesh. Wait, what? Yeah, we need to take uh, ladder three up. Um, oh, that's not ladder. Ladder three is okay. So if I take one down, 
It's like the longest possible route. But uh, I could do it. Um, I'm actually going to save right here because it is bedtime for my daughter. So we're going to go have uh, story time real quick. Um, but then I'll be back with more of this. All right. All right, we're back. Um, I got to remember what I was doing now. The biggest challenge in any video game that's longer than a couple hours. Remembering what you were up to. I think... I have to go back down the ladder, which is that way. Okay. Yeah, we have to go back down the ladder, and then we have to find ladder three, go up and unlock the handcuff door. I think that's it. Yes. Okay. And then once I get down there, I think I go the longest possible way, which let's see if I can remember. Okay. No map. No map challenge. Don't look at your map. Don't do it. Don't look at it. It's tempting. So tempting. I think this is right. Okay. Is this right? Yeah, I got it. Okay. Whew. I was sitting there, I was like, I don't think I got it right. I was sure of it. Here we go. Okay. Um, and within seconds, I'm like, where, where was the handcuff gate? Okay. Wait, and then we go. I think it's right here. We've done it. Wow, another uh, pyramid head slash here. Oh my god. Should have looked up. Tall ceiling. Okay. Hanging out on the inside of the corner like that. <sighs> okay. Maybe we need the stopping power of the shotgun. Hmm. Up there? Or... Oh, right here, okay. Ah, I see. This was on the other side of the, uh, crawl hole. Is that what they're called? I'm like blanking on the name. Crawl hole. <laughs> okay, look. There's some ammo there. Okay, we got another rifle round. Okay, this is a uh, ladder four down the flooded area. If you're curious, my daughter is asleep right now. She was playing with her stuffed bunny and then she fell asleep. I was watching her on the monitor. She likes to make her bunnies hop. 
And we, and we sing a little bunny hop song. Okay, so, uh... Right. Good. Okay, now we go under here. Did it really cave in behind me? Of course. Hmm, I got like wire cutters or something maybe? It's saving. Okay. Y'all, there's a ladder right there. I got the achievement, Inner Sanctum. Oh! Oh. He coming in? Yep, he's coming in, he's coming in! <laughs> okay. He can't climb ladders. His head's too heavy. His pyramid head. Where? Okay, where are we now? Okay. Now see, there was another ladder. Wasn't there? Yeah, there was another ladder. Ladder six, I'm guessing. Oh, my bad, sorry. Look up. Oh, that's a light. That's a light. Oh my gosh, dude. Where? Oh my god, I just don't want to get ambushed by the mannequin. Oh. It's you. Oh my god. Are you serious? Okay, I, I, I missed a couple rifle shots. I'm just, I'm trying to get serious about, um, you know, not getting, uh, any more health drinks taken away from me. Clink, 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 clink. Hmm. That way? We'll go to the left side first, because I think... There's just like one room here. That's all there's room for. All right. Ooh, the wire cutter. So this goes back to the wires, yeah. Okay, I am gonna go back uh, this way. What's over here? Oh, okay. I guess that's it. Okay. Um, wondering if I should go back down and try to go up that those other stairs. 
Because there might be loot there. Is Pyramid Head going to come up here too? Oh, okay. Wait, so... I don't think there's really any point in me staying up here. I think I need to go back down. Yep. Back into the depths. From whence we came. Because this... I mean, it's just too hard to get to the other stair or staircases. L ladders from there. Okay. Is he, is he down there? I just wanted to go up this ladder right here. What's this? Yeah, that is ladder six. Oh, it's just the mandarins. They're just throwing a little temper tantrum down there. Huh. Okay. Just ammo and a syringe and a strange photo. Whole world ahead of us. Great photo. You can really see all the detail. Okay, so that's all that's here. So here's the strat. We go back down ladder six. We go straight to the wires. So we come down, we head to the left. Pyramid head is right here. We loop them. We head straight for the wires. Okay, that's we got ourselves a plan Now you'd think with an iron pipe we could you know bash these uh, pieces of wood off, but I digress Here, this is it. Wow, you were able to do that so fast, James. Good job. Okay. Very red in here. Ladder number seven. Oh, oh. Yeah, I didn't see him. He was just watching us. He was watching me. Okay. <gasps> this is what we do it for. One health drink. Back to 29. Damn. I really thought we were going to hit the 50 club. This is gonna put us... Wait, where is this gonna put us? I guess we'll just hop down. Yep.
Are we back in the main area? I think so. We are. You know, I'm just gonna use a health drink. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. Does it make sense to use a syringe? I did that, you know. Because I thought it was fun. Wait, is that not it? Triangle cross. Oh no, it's the other way. Wait, that's not right, is it? Let me look. I don't think this is correct, though. No. This just kind of... Yeah, we can't hop down. Probably for the best. Because then I don't know if there would be a way back up. Okay. What is this? This is even gonna be. Oh wait, I, I did this before, didn't I? Okay. We're trying to make that shape. I'm just. I keep getting hits. There we go. This is the one. I'm pretty sure. expecting this to open. Ruined area map. Oh. Oh, I see. Those are the ones that we opened earlier. So this is the third and final labyrinth. Red means scary, y'all. I don't believe you. Mm -hmm. I still don't believe you. I don't believe any of you. Liars. I knew it. Wow. Not sure I'm loving this power strip right here. Was it was it even plugged into? I don't think it's plugged into anything. Okay, wait, what? Okay, so there's only two doors that you can go through here. Oh, but then what about this? <laughs> Huh. Oh. Rifle rounds four. I got four. Okay, okay. We were back here. Uh. So these all are closed except for this. Oh, okay. James, I need you to. Okay, you do have each individual squiggle for all of them. Oh! 
It has run out of battery. No, I gotta get more battery. I'm thrilled to report my controller has new batteries. Okay, these guys are gonna definitely come to life, huh? Okay. Ha! Ah. 30, we're back to 30. Whew. Wow, okay. They're, they're being very generous with the ammo here. I'm liking it. Okay, so... This is the same apartment again. Right? Oh, no, it's not. It's slightly different. I think there's a door over here, but I don't think I can go through it. But you can crawl through. You can shimmy through here. This is where the nurse came from. I want to make sure that we get everything that we can get. Oh, come on. Four rifle rounds. Let's go. So this one is just a straight combat sequence, basically, compared to the other areas. It's going to slowly, slowly deteriorate. I'm guessing it'll make a square or something. No mandarins. There's 
so tough. Wait, did I just outlast them? I didn't need to kill them. Oh, I was like, oh wait, no, or did I? Did I kill them? Maybe I did. I just, I thought they were still hanging on. There we go. Immediately used. Okay. And we're back to full health. Okay, yeah, I guess we're done. I hate those hanging guys. They're... I'm trying to save ammo. Because I'm a little low at the moment. I was like... Well, I mean, okay. All right. I mean... <laughs> I know it says I have 21 rifle ammo, but like, you know, one boss and that's all gone. That's all I'm saying. Oh boy. Okay, so we're actually, we're, we're heading that way. Got a couple more rooms. Is it gonna vibrate again? Okay, it's that again. Wait, what? Uh. This seems. Get me through, dude. Get me through. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Come on. Come on. All right. Wow, even they make way for Pyramid Head. There's a hierarchy even with those monster things. Well, I guess, what are those things? Are they like mannequins? Oh! Marie? Interesting. <laughs> um, my controller vibrated. What did she die from? The plague? Just wanted to see. Okay. So 
So what, we get back to the rotating cube? Or is the strange wall through now? We heard what I assume to be Mary again. Ah. Uh. Sick. We got our own great knife. Wait, isn't it this way? And now you will let me pass. Okay. It's I have I have no idea. I've noticed this too when I'm moving like the tables around to go up and above. It's it's hard. They don't respond well to turning while moving forward. I'm not sure exactly why that is. So it results in some awkward movement. You know, we could have dropped it way back there, but okay. James just wanted to hold on to it for a little longer. This felon drank one last bottle of ale before he was executed and laid here to his eternal rest. Okay. Oh. Oh, am I, am I choosing which one to jump in or? Angela Orozco. Oh, that's her last name. Yeah. So that newspaper article that we read with the Oro, Thomas Oro? It was Thomas Orozco. Eddie Dombrowski. James Sunderland. Huh. Miriam K. Trader. Oh, that was the younger of the uh, siblings, right? Killed by Walter Sullivan. Time to uh, jump into our own grave, I guess.
Couldn't leave well enough alone, huh? You just had to follow me all the way out here. How many times do I have to kill you? Eddie. Whoa, Eddie. It's, it's me. Oh. Uh. Hi, James. Eddie. What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? You fat, disgusting piece of shit! You make me sick! You gonna cry, fat ass? You gonna run to your mama? Waste of skin! Why don't you just kill yourself? Well... Maybe he was right. Maybe I am. Nothing but a fat, disgusting piece of shit. But you know what? It doesn't matter if you're smart, dumb, ugly, pretty. It's all the same once you're dead. And a corpse can't laugh! Eddie. What's that? You want to talk down to me some more? Tell me to relax? You're just like the rest of them, James. No, I don't want to. Shut up! You think I'm stupid. You think I don't see it. But you've been laughing at me all along. Ever since we first met. But you ain't laughing now, are you? Jeez. You need help, Eddie. Don't get all holy on me, James. This town called you too. Yeah, you and me are the same. We're not like other people, don't you know that? Well, you're about to find out. Huh. Is this the same guy from the cafeteria? Mr. Anime Protagonist over here. Oh, it's really cold here in this corner. I re I'm too weak. I need to be stronger. I want to kill every Titan. Uh... All right. Sorry. Do you know what it does to you, James? When you're hated, picked on, spit on? Just because of the way you look? Yeah, I ran away after I killed that dog. But you know what? It was fun! It tried to chew its own guts up. Finally died all curled up in a ball. I forgot about this. Then he came after me. I shot him too, right in the leg. He cried more than the dog. <laughs> Now it's your turn, James! <gasps> I see you! Yeah? I'm gonna corner tech you. you oh. Come on. Yeah, well, you, you can't shoot me. Damn, it's like a PvP match. Ow. Look at him. Yeah, this is what I save my rifle shots for.
Eddie, you're losing hard at this, buddy. I don't know how to tell you this. I can see you. How's that possible? I'm turning my light off. Okay, well then now I can't see. How many shots does this guy take? How is it possible? Come on. I, uh, I don't think so. I don't think it's even going to happen once. He ran that way. There he is. This is it, Jay. I mean, what choice do we really have? I got an achievement, a human being. Kill Eddie. I think it's a bit, Eddie's a bit more of a tragic character in this version of the game than he, he was in the original. Because in the original, he comes across <laughs> like way more evil, talking about killing the dog. I mean, he did that in this one too, but the performance in the original, he sounds a lot more like, uh, ruthless, I guess. So that's the way out, okay? Just wanna make sure I'm not missing anything. I think I'm good. Yeah, I think overall, I... Eddie was never one of my favorite characters in the original game, so... Probably, he was probably my least favorite character in the original game. He's probably my least favorite character in the remake, too. So, I don't know. We're kind of back to square one with Eddie, I feel like. Oh, oh my god. We're back in Silent Hill. It's good to be back. Where are we right now? Oh, a health drink. Yash. Oh. And a strange photo. Road trip! Of course they got... It looks like it's water! I think more like a boat trip. Hmm. Alright, well we'll go ahead and uh, save right here. I'm not sure what... Uh, Toluca Lake. I was about to say, I'm not sure where we are. James refuses to check his map, but that'll do it for this time. Stop looking at it, James. Look out, look out the water or something like that. Yeah, yeah, stand over here for the outro. So yeah, we had two boss battles in this video. We had the Abstract Daddy and Eddie Dombrowski. And it appears as if Maria has died, Eddie has died, and Angela is just somewhere out there. We haven't seen Laura in a hot minute. And we still haven't found Mary, so that's kind of the status of things. But, um, 
I will say on the game overall so far, and I probably had this opinion about the original too, I liked the apartments, I really liked the hospital, and then the prison and the labyrinth are the parts of the game where I'm like, eh, you know, it's still fine, but not my favorite parts, and I think that probably remains true with this one. But, uh, yeah, uh, let me know what you're thinking about things so far. I'm not sure how much of the game is left. I don't want to spoil too much, but next video may be the last one, or it may be one more after that, depending on how things go and how long the videos are. But, yeah, just uh, giving you a heads up. All right, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Think critically.